This video is sponsored by Sketchfab. Stick around to see how you can get high quality 3D models for free. Hey, hey what's up guys and welcome back to Ask Entry. Today we're doing a simple rundown of Blender add-ons that were released within the week. A couple of add-ons update and if you look closely enough, you might be able to spot a premium add-on that you can actually get for free and a couple of generators. And this week we're having the biggest Blender geometry generators giveaway that has ever existed. And this is just too much stuff. With that said, let's get right into it. Digital set dressing is a realistic urban detail 3D kit bash for lifelike renders. This is also an asset browser friendly, which would allow you create some urban looking environment. And this comprises of city scenes that you might want to recreate. And with realistic set of details, things can actually look way lively than you kind of expect. So these are built with real life purposes as most of these things are 3D scans to bring the best quality to you. This 3D package contains a huge number of assets that cuts across different categories of buildings, some rust, some revolution kits, some industrial warehouse stuff, electrical, building environment, waste, plumbing, mechanical, water removal, and so many others. So if you're thinking about doing a more realistic set dressing and you kind of figured out that there is something right here that might be useful to you, you can simply go ahead and check it out. Car Teleporter is a selection of premium cars and these cars are quite exquisite ones that you can use for your projects but they are all editorial licensed which means if you would like to use this things for commercial projects you might need to get license from either Tesla or from any of these car companies that these cars were modeled after. Furthermore, these car assets come fully rigged and you can play with the 80 plus set of assets that comes with this. It makes sense to know that Elmer has made this one available and for those who like to check it out you can simply go over to Blender Market or on Gumroad and grab them for yourself. Material Asset Pack is a huge collection of material libraries built for the asset browser and this is quite impressive for those who are looking for extra materials that they can use on their model. So this comprises of both floor, ground, wall, paint, glows, metal, plastic, wood, rock and so many others. All of these materials are procedural and at the same time the customization for either of them is pretty simple. And for those looking for some extra premium materials that they might want to work with, this 70 plus pack actually brings a lot to the table. The folks at GTEC Design has also made a couple of other add-ons previously that we've mentioned and some of the ones that are pretty new right now is the Type Text add-on. Now this add-on is pretty impressive for those who like to create motion graphic style stuff and you're looking for a faster way of creating these things really quick in Blender. This 28 plus preset actually adds a little bit more to what you're creating. You might also find a couple of other things that they've made pretty impressive like the easy displacer for displacing stuff. There's also the foliage painting tool which we've already talked about previously and finally the surface detail add-on. So if any of this interests you, you can simply come over to the storefronts and check out these things for yourself. Tarkit is a collection of node groups made available by just 3D things and this actually allows you create amazing patterns. Now for those who are thinking about creating different kinds of patterns from bricks to different kinds of tiles with access to changing how the styles are patterned and as well how they display on your model with extra access to surface imperfections and details then you might want to consider checking out the tile kit. The tile kit comes with a couple of demos so you're not just going to get the textures themselves you'll also be able to have access to demos which you can tweak and also work with. This is specifically made for Blender users and especially for Blender users who would love to get that same experience with Substance Designer and probably can create patterns with it. So instead of creating these patterns with Substance Designer and transporting those things back over to Blender, you can simply take advantage of the tile kit from just 3D things and get to work. Terrainscapes is made available by the folks at Contrast Render and the idea for Terrainscape is to offer Blender users a couple of terrain assets that they can tweak to their heart's content and these assets are quite a lot as you also have access to tweaking their materials and it's quite impressive to see that these materials control the vegetation, the flow map, the snow map, the rock map and so much more. So for those who like to check this one out, it makes sense to know that you can actually get a trial version for $1 which would offer you 5 different terrains and a couple of 4k maps. The nice asset pack made by M. Gordon, a Ukrainian that reached out to me once he made this public and it is quite impressive to see the amount of work that he has put into this. Now this has been by far one of the largest collection of materials that I've seen for Blender and it is quite impressive. This contains 540 ready to use materials that is pretty impressive that you might want to consider looking at and all of these are high quality stuff with 2k maps. 
Like we mentioned with previous tools, these are asset browser friendly and you would also notice that you have a long list of material types to pick from, from terrain to road to metal overlays that you can use. It's quite impressive to see that this Ukrainian freelancer has come up with a material pack like this. So for those who like to support this, probably you want to come check it out. I'm going to put a link in the description where you can find it. Punch it is a dedicated single purpose blender add-on featuring the very native manifold extrude tool that exists with blender now this actually attempts to work more reliably than what you can get with blender rather than the native blender manifold extrusion now this is quite impressive for those who like to cut through stuff then you might want to consider checking out punch it machine 3 has actually made a couple of other things and it's worth knowing that punch it works exclusively with blender 3.0 Architecture Elements and Flow 2.6, the ultimate architectural asset pack, is now here. Now, the folks at Digital Architecture, the creators of this amazing set of tools, has released an update to this ultimate asset manager alongside with the assets that you can get with it. Now, this would save you lots of time looking for assets for your project, organize your models and material library, and for those wondering what and what they'll be able to get within the architectural element pack, you'll be able to have over 250 customizable assets, 100 completely unique PBR photorealistic materials, the flow asset manager, which is probably the best asset manager for Blender that just makes your workflow even way more easier and faster. And at the same time, for those who like to consider checking out this, you probably might want to test it out before you go ahead and purchase it. You can simply go over to the website where you can download the trial version of their interior essentials and the flow asset add-on that they've made or you can simply purchase these in two variants. Fluent is a hard surface modeling add-on made for Blender artists that are looking at ways to expand their hard surface modeling skills. This comes with a whole lot of features and tools that will just change the way you work. Fluent 2.0 was made from the ground up and there is a huge update to the UI. There is also a couple of updates to performance and how you get to work with it. And there is a radial set of tools that just simply makes your working even way easier. There is a very tiny quote here that actually warns you that if you want to be an elite monster amongst hearts of his artists, then you might want to consider checking this out. Retopo Flow 3 has gotten an update. Retopo Flow 3.2.6 is now here, and it is quite impressive to see that Retopo Flow is the tool that you need, especially if you're thinking about doing the topology directly in Blender. It is quite impressive the amount of work that folks at CG Cookie has put into this tool. For those thinking about creating poly strips, or maybe you're just thinking about creating strokes and converting those strokes to topology, or maybe you like to use the poly pen, the knife tool, some relaxing, you know, lots of things. You might probably be thinking about creating patches as well. Then Retopo Flow is your best friend. And for those who like to get this and also get support for this, it is what no that you need to come through and get it right here on blender market however there is actually one that you can get right here on github and this one is totally free so as much as you can get this one from github it is worth knowing that there is no support for this and while we talk about you getting this for free on github this is targeted for developers either ways if you would like to get this update you can simply come over to blender market and get it or if you're a developer or probably you want to test it out and see what and what you can do with it, you can get it right here on GitHub. Physical Starlight and Atmosphere now has a brand new update. Physical Starlight and Atmosphere is a completely volumetric procedural sky, sunlight and atmosphere simulator for Blender. This tool has been in active usage and developments over a period of time and it makes sense to see that version 1.5.0 comes with a couple of nice things. So we're looking at 5 brand new presets, some improvements, some bug fixes. At the same time, it is now built into the Blender Asset Browser instead of the custom preset functionalities. Now there's just a lot of things that you can do with this add-on so if you're looking for an atmospheric tool that you can use to give that beautiful set of procedural sky some sunlight and some atmosphere to your next scene then this might just be it for you the RBD tool is a fracturing add-on that takes advantage of the Blender physics system for fracturing objects and making them explode. Now with this tool, you can add smoke debris and some advanced constraints to your model and get that close to life simulation. And for those who've already purchased this, RBD Lab 1.1.2 is now here and it is worth updating. This week we're getting a couple of free add-ons and we're starting off with Amon Deep. This creator never sleeps, he always creates crazy, amazing, awesome, useful add-ons every single time. And this week is no exception. The Angle Loop Selection is a free add-on that you can get on his Gumroad right now. And we've already talked about this creator countless times. Every single week there is one stuff that he's making 
We've talked about the cavity pass add-on. We've, we've talked about the quick UV checkers, the align and distribute, the bacon node. We've also talked about the wonderful geo cables. And right now, if you go over to his gum road, you would see that he has the end gun loop totally for free. By the way, if you would like to support this artist, you love what you see, you want to support him, give him that encouragement to continually make free add-ons then you might want to consider checking out his blender market stock from so if you're excited about any of these add-ons and you like to support the developer you can simply come through and check out all of his tools from RAM tools all the way to the end on loop select but of course if you like to get this for free you can definitely go over to the gumroad where you can download these and get it for free the RAM tools is also a hat surface tool that he has made and this is also pretty impressive for those who like to consider checking that out as well now most of you guys would love this one as it's coming from Stormberger. Now this add-on is a replication of what you can do with Maya as it is a Maya style merging tool. So for those who like editing meshes and probably you're thinking about how you can merge several vertices, several edges and faces together, then this tool is definitely one that you should consider looking at. It is totally free. It makes sense to see that a tool like this now exists for Blender and regardless of that there's a couple of other tools that you might also be able to find with this. So I'm going to put this link in the description for those who are looking for something like this for a very long time, especially for Maya artists that just moved recently to Blender and you're thinking about seeing tools that are quite familiar. There's also a couple of other things that you might be able to find here. And with that said, let's talk about the biggest Blender giveaway in a very long time. Blender is has given out every single thing that he has made on his Gumroad for free. This is running from now till the end of this month, which is March of 2022. And it's quite crazy what this creator is doing. Now, the whole idea of this is to help support the problems going on in Ukraine right now. And it is also to help support Blender artists trying to get these things in their hands and also play with it. For those who want to pick up any of this and you want to play with it from the tree generator, the IV, the freeze, this is a cool one. The freeze generator, the circuit board generator as well, or maybe you want to get the cord generator, any of these things you're looking for, you can pick this up right now. It is quite impressive to see a community gather together to support those in the times of need and at the same time show that level of sportsmanship to everyone that has no opportunity of purchasing these tools. So for those who like to get any of these things, I'm going to put a link in the description. I can bring you right here where you can get all of the procedural generators that Blender is, has made. And I think in one way or the other, we should show appreciation back to this creator by posting this video on Twitter with his handle and my handle with the hashtag thank you blender is i think this way we can appreciate this creator for what he's doing to the entire blender community as well as encourage other creators to do this very same thing so tell me what you guys think about this one probably it might fly probably it might not fly but i think one good turn of course really deserves another and that's about it but before we go let's give a huge shout out to our sponsor sketchfab so you guys already know that sketchfab is one of the largest places on the internet where you can buy and sell your 3d models it's also worth knowing that Sketchfab is just that amazing place where you can preview 3D models either via thumbnails or by clicking on the models and previewing them before you hit the download button. And for anyone who's looking for free and amazing content every single week, you can simply go over to sketchfab.com, go over to explore, go to downloadables, where you'll be able to download a truckload of free stuff every week. And just like you can have access to free add-ons every single week that will bring to you guys, that is exactly how you can have access to free models and also free props and free stuff from the folks at Sketchfab. So if you're thinking about a wonderful place where you can download free models or probably you're looking for a place where you can buy or sell your 3D models, then Sketchfab is the place for you. Tell me what you guys think about this one in the comment section. And of course, if you like this video or you learned something from this, you can go ahead and give a like and don't forget to share with a friend. And until I see you guys in the next one, peace.